usually that means it's snapper time. And that plant is just buzzing with bees. Well, as you can see, because of the terrible weather, we are land-based fishing. So the rain and the storms that were forecast just meant I couldn't go out in the kayak. Now, in all seriousness, it's a beautiful day, but it's meant to be raining in a storm. So hopefully that arrives later. I'm going to be very pissed off that I could have been out there on the kayak. But at least we're having a fish anyway. So we're out here land-based. Hopefully we can find some gummies. Fingers crossed, if we can get a land based red, I'd be absolutely stoked in the middle of the day. There's a couple of gummy heads down here. Um, I'm gonna chuck them in the water so it doesn't reek up here, but anyway, um, they might have been caught last night. So, rig up these rods, get them out. Looks beautiful. Hopefully, we get the place to ourselves. It'll be just a nice day. Anyway, let's get stuck into it. All right, first bait's just gonna be a little pilly. We've got double snell just because, in case of a snapper, early season, they like to just touch the bait and not do much. But this might get shredded by toadies and stuff, but anyway, that's the rig. And to a sinker slider, it's actually not that long of a leader because it's off my kayak setup. Um, but if it busts off, we will change that up. We can make it a bit longer. Grab out a sinker. I don't know how much is going to be needed. Probably that. Hopefully, that gets enough for the day. We have big tides today too, which is nice. Been here previous times when been very small tides and still caught gummies, so should be enough water for other fish to come up and have a squiz. Night, obviously in the shallows is usually probably the best, but I like me day fishing. I'm just hoping, because I've had brothers been here before and he's been the first one here and ended up having just tons of people rock up and can get tangled in other people's lines and stuff. So hopefully, day's quiet. Well, the people that come here don't try and just fish on the exact same spot as me. Be nice. Anyway, there's those gummy heads. You can see how small a gummy can be to be kept. So that one there's a bit smaller. That one would have been all right. But anyway, looks like there was a few then. Three heads down here. Would have been that full moon last night, high tide. It's been good. Looks like they were, I don't know if they've been freshly getting off the oyster things too. Because they're looking all undone. And we've already got a tangle. Need the bait to go over that way. Oh, I don't know how this is going to work. Come back to me. Is that what this is going over there? All right, whip the bail arm over and see how far we can peg this bad boy. <laughs> Not my greatest cast. We will get better. It's been a little while since I've done the land based. i just flick the bail arm and walk it up here because I'm a little easy. Probably don't have to take it up this high. You could just have it set down lower but I know the tide's going to get up later. And I'm going to do a loose drag today. Very loose and that way run off. I can tighten up and set the hooks. Anyway, I won't take you through the next one. It's going to be pretty much the same except put a little bit of squid on there and probably just one hook. One real fine gauge hook and we'll get stuck into it. This one looks like it's getting a little bit more action than the usual. What is that in my gumbit? Hmm. It's just the waves. Might be 
across the waves. Just so they go a bit more frequent waves. Damn. Water is coming in. Should be starting to hopefully pick up from now on since we're a bit closer to high tide. So about three hours till the high tide. Surely some fish come up from for feed. Come on. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Seem too big. Yet. Come on, what have we got? Well, let's get this in there. I don't know. I don't know what we got. Any gummy or something? A little schooly. A little schooly, I think. Maybe a little gummy. Not sure. Let's go have a look. Maybe it's a little gummy. <laughs> Little gumbo. Hey buddy. Little one, but we got one. That's not too bad. Little fella. Little, little one. Get him on his way. On the Sari, put another Sari on. All right, that took a little while, about an hour and a half. We finally got our first gummy, use a little one, but hopefully it starts to pick up. I was on a Sari head. I'll just put on the tail part of it and hopefully it stays on all right. Um, it doesn't spin too much, but anyway, nice little one. So hopefully we can catch one that's a little bit bigger. I'm gonna release all mine today though. Um, so yeah, let's see if we can't get some more. All right, just hid behind a tree a bit. The wind's picked up and in the distance, the clouds are coming. So probably we'll get a bit wet, a bit stormy, maybe. We'll see. Um, it's nearly high tide, so I've chucked out another fresh bait, put the soury head on again. Hopefully it can get something. The squid hasn't had much except for little toadies picking at it. So anyway. Stick around for a little bit longer. We might even actually miss that if we're gone by then because I was staying around till the high tide. So we're nearly there and we'll stay for a little bit after it, but not much action today so far. One gummy, not many other bites. All right, gonna call it a day. It's been very quiet. The rain never arrived. The thunderstorm never arrived either. So, you know, Beautiful flat day, could have been on the kayak. Picked up a little bit wind at one point, but it was nearly at slack tide and didn't get very choppy at all. So anyway, wind these in and pack it up and head home. But at least we got one gummy, so that was nice. Catch us in the next one.